so we have two bookshelves and it looks like we like to keep all of the really heavy books in the lower shelf and all of the lighter books on the upper shelf, which kind of makes sense. So we know that the heaviest book on the upper shelf is 400 pages and the lightest book in the lower shelf is 475 pages. We need to find the median number of pages for all of the books in the two shelves and that's going to be kind of tricky, I think. Let's go ahead and look at the statements. So each statement on its own just gives us the number of books on a single shelf, but without knowing how many books there are all together or how many books there are in the other shelf, this couldn't possibly be sufficient to answer the question. So we should probably go ahead and eliminate A, B, D and just figure out whether the answer is C or E. Now, when we combine these statements, I think it's very interesting that there is exactly one more book in the upper shelf than in the lower shelf, because that means that the heaviest book on the upper shelf would be the midpoint in a set. Like if we arranged all of the different numbers of pages of all 49 books in ascending order, the heaviest book in the upper shelf would be the midpoint. And we know what the heaviest book in the upper shelf is. It has 400 pages, so now we can tell that the median of all of the books is 400 pages, and therefore the correct answer is C. If you found this video useful, go to quantreasoning.com for a lot more where that came from. You should also click that like button and let me know in the comments below what you'd like me to make future videos about. And of course, if you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and do that and click that bell below so you get notified about future videos. See you next time.